Hey guys, today I have a haul to share with you. Um, most of these things are from Walmart, and it's a collective haul, so I don't know how much of this will still be available at your local places. First, I got some stamps. Um, I either paid 50 cents or a dollar for these, or 97 cents. They're by Studio G. And there's this little alphabet. And then, that was one trip. And then I had a birthday party because my birthday's on the 12th. And I got some gifts that are somewhat scrapbook related. So, one of my friends got me this journal. It's got some foil on it, some beautiful butterflies and flowers and patterns. And there's that little magnetic closure. And then you just open it like that. And then, this is the inside cover. And don't mind the orange light, that's just the camera. It's a nice bluish gray color with brown tones and yellows. And then all the pages are the same. And they have these corner things like that one. And this one. And then the back is the same as the front, just minus the foil. So I got that really pretty journal. Oh, and there's a spine if you want to see it. Flowered. And this is the company that made this is Punch Studio. And it's 104 pages. And then from another friend I got some stickers. There are these beach ones. Which are really cute. And these camping ones. And I got these alphabet ones. And there's 614 pieces in this. And there's a bunch of colors. And there's three sheets. And those stickers are all by EK Success. And then the next thing that I got as a present was this paper pad. 50 sheets. And it's a pattern pack called Happy Days. And I'm just going to flip through it. It's not your traditional paper, but I think it'd be fun to use on my summer layout. So there's that by Colorbach. And then I went to Walmart yesterday and they had some stuff on clearance. So I got another stamp that I don't have yet. And this one just says, you are the best. I don't think it... There you see it. Rubber. And then I saw this. It's called Decorative Tape. And it's 9.83 feet long by 0.7 inches wide. And I don't know if it's going to be like washi tape or like normal tape. So either way, it's really cute colors. Summary. That was 88 cents. And the stamp was 50 cents. And then I got these. Studio G cards and envelopes set. And as you can see, they have a little cutout here, which I think will be really fun to use. Um, these are 50 cents for eight cards and envelopes. So, that's nice. And then, I got the Studio G Halloween. I don't think this has a name. It was last year's Halloween uh, kit. I have the papers from this and the brads for it. And they still have more of this stuff. Well, this was all that I saw for 20 cents. They also had the stickers, the normal ones. These are chipboard. But for 20 cents, I thought I had the papers. Why not get the cute? So I got two of those. And the reason I got two was one's for a giveaway that's coming up. Because my birthday, I decided to celebrate with you guys too. So be on the lookout for that. And then there's a Colorbach paper pad called Dossier. If that's how you say it, I have no idea. That's how I'm going to say it. Um, but there's 24 sheets of paper, two with foil, 150 stickers, and 76 die cuts for $2.50. And these are my favorite colors with the blues and the greens. And those little crossword um, paper, graph paper, writing, polka dots. Like, they have everything. And there's, like, some masculine papers in here, which is nice, because there's a lot of dainty stuff, too. Some greens. 
browns and tans. My favorite color is that use the stickers, this bluish color, but I also really like gray. And these are the stickers. I haven't actually looked at them all yet because I didn't cut the, but there's even a little type there. There's three of each letter, including X's, which is really nice. But that is all for my haul today. Here's another shot of the uh, papers in there. But that's it for today, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, go check out my blog because I have a lot of stuff up on there because videos are harder for me to make for me because I've been really busy. And I'll probably have more stuff up on here soon, including a watercolor tutorial with my aqua pens because someone asked for that. So I'll get that up as soon as I can because we're rearranging the room again, so everything is everywhere. So I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.